Boston is becoming to me a case study in system failure. Just look at it from a 30,000 foot point of view. You have Russian intelligence services contacting two agencies within our federal government responsible for our national security, the FBI and the CIA. They tell us, we believe you have a radical Islamist in your midst. We do interviews, we do some things that I think are, are pretty responsible. However, this suspected radical Islamist is able to go back to Russia, to Dakistan, without the FBI or the CIA being made aware of it, even though Homeland Security was. That's system failure almost 12 years after 9-11. And it gets worse. The suspected radical Islamist, the person we got warning letters about, is openly on the internet for months talking about killing Americans and engaging in radical jihad against the United States and we were unable to connect the dots and pick that up. The rest is history. Between Benghazi and Boston, our systems are failing and we're going backwards. We need to understand that bin Laden may be dead, but the war against radical Islam is very much alive. Radical Islam is on the march and we need to up our game.